Hey everybody, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitters here for the Wrestling Mayhem Show.com. Brought to you in part by our good friends, PittsburghWrestling.com. Some uh, great shows there. We're leading up to a big uh, Night of the Superstars in Meadville as of, as of this recording. And you can check out the big story this week. Uh, WrestleMania Legends in our roster of uh, digital downloads over at SorgatronMedia.com, actually. Uh, and, and find out who's been around. Uh, Mick Foy, Superfly Jimmy Snuka, Tito Santana, the current Corey Graves, formerly Sterling J- James Keenan and was a staple around here on plenty of the titles we have available over there. And plus 25% off with the code MANIA for digital downloads uh, to get a little bit of a break this WrestleMania season. Um, But uh, in the meantime, speaking of WrestleMania, we're leading into it. I want to talk a little bit about the mainstream attention that you have with WrestleMania. Again, some people say, I I think a lot of the, I don't know, probably I'm listening to the hardest of the hardcore of wrestling fans when we have these discussions, but there's a little bit, much like the guest uh, hosts groan, uh, I know we've talked about over the last couple of shows, be it uh, uh, the Raw Wrap Up or yesterday on the Mayhem Minute, um, but anytime I see a mainstream star pop up on Raw, I say, good for wrestling, right? It's, it's exposure for wrestling. It brings credibility to a form, to wrestling. Um, and when I see, like, what happens with, you know, WrestleMania season, you have so many interviews. And this is something that, again, you can just put your head down into like a soft pillow um, and, and just enjoy for the week. I'm looking, of course, everything's blowing the F up for uh, Brock Lesnar's announcement yesterday on ESPN. On ESPN, he announced that he's re-signing with WWE. We talked about this a little bit on Wrestling Mayhem Show uh, uh, 462 uh, last night. It's up uh, going to be up today at WrestlingMayhemShow.com. And... Uh, Again, that announcement happened there. I spoke on just a little bit ago, recording 30 Days of WrestleMania, how the tale of the tape for Floyd Mayweather and uh, Big Show was in USA Today. And on top of the podcasts and interviews, uh, that's what is... Oh, it's every headline at WrestleZone.com right now. Hi, Justin Labar. Um, and it's, uh, you, know, you know, stuff kind of, you know, Triple H confirming Rock Lesnar's new contract is multi-year, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. He's going to have that belt forever. Um, it's, you, but you look at this and you see that them pop, they're popping up on, uh, uh, well, Triple H, that's what I was going to do. Triple H, he, he was, he was uh, comparing his, his uh, WrestleMania lead up as a performer versus as now an executive. Uh, now I guess he's a little bit of both usually because he usually has a match at WrestleMania. But still, um, enjoy this. You know, it's unprecedented uh, 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 access to all these guys, you know. And it pops up every once in a while as one person or two does media uh, for whatever the town is for Raw. I know that people popped up all over the place here uh, when they were here for Raw recently. Um, but uh, you know, it, it's... A lot of opportunity there because it seems like everybody is doing media. Nobody sleeps. I'm telling you, nobody in WWE sleeps leading into WrestleMania this entire week. Now with the network even producing even more content and getting that involved, WWE fan access, so much more. Um, so I, I guess a little bit, you know, enjoy that. And what do you think about that? Is there any good tidbits? Is there somebody? I know there's a couple people that always seem to pop up doing interviews uh, every year. Uh, during this, what's what's the what's the greatest thing out of maybe this WrestleMania or WrestleMania's past that you normally wouldn't see, but because of the season, you're checking out in the media or seen it t- turned on your TV and saw WrestleMania and WWE pop up in the strangest places. Um, I'm loving some of the stuff coming over the headlines t- this morning. Let me know what you thought on this video uh, on YouTube, or if you're checking us out anywhere else in the comments section, if that's available, or hit us up Wrestling Mayhem Show on Facebook, Google Plus, and at Mayhem Show on Twitter and uh, we'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.